Jai Hind everyone, I am Pankaj Kumar and today uh, we will see the fat digestion and their absorption. So as you know, the fat will be the insoluble particle of the uh, food matter. So how we can make it solubilized? Whenever you will eat any oily substance, so what you are eating actually? You are eating the fat. So fat will go by the mouth, then esophagus and then stomach. So till stomach there will be not uh, proper digestion of the fat will be occur the proper digestion of the fat will start from the intestine so where it will start digesting after the duodenum so duodenum will get the uh, bile salt from the gall bladder and this gall bladder will consist of trochoic bile salt and that trochoic bile salt will be synthesized in the liver and stored in the gall bladder and then it will release and it will do the emulsification of the fat as you can see the first step that is uh, written as a emulsification so these are the missiles or the bile salts which will form a missile like structure so missiles like uh, you can see it is a round and it will be surrounded by all the bile salts so suppose this is a lipid now it will be surrounded by all the bile salts okay so it will be surrounded by this so what will be happen now this uh, fat will be easily break down this fat can be easily break down and it will be become solubilized so lipase which is soluble in uh, water that lipase enzyme will able to act on this lipid okay this fat now now if you see uh, the once it will form a missiles then it will become the so as you seen the bile salt will surround the fat and if it is surrounding this fat then now lipase can able to act on this so lipase will degrade the triglycerol so <coughs> triglycerol the break down into the triglycerol into the <laughs> glycerol and fatty acids now you can see the fatty acid and other breakdowns product can be entered into the mucosal cell so fatty acid will be break down is the product of the degradation of the triglycerol and it is degraded by which enzyme it is degraded by lipase now fatty acid will enter into the it will enter into the intestinal mucosa and converted again into the tri triglycerol this is the important step now this triglycerol again it is a insoluble so what we need we need something which can be solubilized this and it will be able to go into the blood so we need to surround this triglycerol by a protein okay by a protein that is called chylomicrotin so are incor incorporated with the cholesterol and apolipoprotein so apo means separate separate protein from the lipid so it will surround and this complete structure is known as what this now this complete structure is known as what chylomicrotin now it is ready to go into the blood stream from villi so it is absorbed from the villi went to the mucosal cell and then uh, from mucosal cell it, it is it is uh, converted into again triglycerol and then from triglycerol again it went to the uh, from via the lacteals it went to the blood stream now if you see the blood stream the fat is now ready lipoprotein lipases will be there this lipoprotein lipases will digest what again it will digest the triglyceride into the fatty acid and fatty acid and mono monoacyl glycerol or the diacyl glycerol so this lipase lipoprotein lipase will be always inactive but it will be activated by the enzyme which is called apoc2 so now this lipoprotein lipases is work is done what it did it did the 
breakdown of the triacylglycerol into the fatty acid and monoacylglycerol. Now this fatty acid entered into the myocyte or the adipocyte. So what is the myocyte and the adipocyte? Myocyte and adipocytes are the uh, muscle cells and liver cell respective. Sorry, uh, adipocyte will be the cell of the uh, storage cell for the fat. It will be in the animal, <coughs> any uh, like mammary gland or the other regions. Okay, so it is a fat storage cell. Now this fatty acid enter into the cell. Either it can be utilized for the energy. Or beta oxidation will occur, or it will be re sterified and will become and stored into the cell. So now I have one question: Do plant have a fat? You just give your answer in your comment. I will let you know the exact answer. So do plant have fat? If yes, then how it will be digested? If no, then how they will get the energy from for the their metabolic activities so do you know how much percentage of the fat will be produced the energy it will be produced almost 40 percent of the energy for our bodies thanks for watching till now we will meet in the next video Jai.